Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can make changes to many payroll item fields directly within the Employee Defaults window. You can select Maintain from the menu bar, roll down to Default Information, and then choose the Employees command to view the information in the Employee Defaults window after you have completed the Payroll Setup Wizard within Peachtree. The General tab contains the field for Locality, if it's used in Payroll, as well as custom fields that allow you to store custom employee data of your choosing. You can also select the desired option button to specify your choice for employee payroll name display within this tab. On the Employee Fields tab, you can view and edit payroll fields which affect the employee pay, such as deductions, additions, and exceptions. Once these fields have been created in the Employee Defaults window, they are then available for use by all employees. You can then customize these individual fields for each employee's personal record later on as needed. The Company Fields tab allows you to view and edit payroll fields used to track the employer's payroll information, such as company paid payroll taxes, for example. Starting in Peachtree 2010, you also have the Review Ratings and Employment Status tabs. You can enter default employee ratings into the Review Ratings tab. You can enter up to 10 statuses used to measure employee performance, such as a numeric performance rating, for example, on this tab. Now you can enter up to 10 employment statuses into the Employment Status tab. There are some provided by default, and you can choose to keep them and add more if needed, or you can recreate them all as you prefer. Now once you've made any changes that you wish to within this window, you can then click the OK button to apply your changes to the company file. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.